need to start treating these men properly with the right medications. And right now, currently in the state we're in, uh, you know, I, I was a victim of that and I didn't abuse it. It was long-term use that resulted in constant thoughts of suicide and depression and rage and all these things that were neurologically disrupting my life. And I uh, can't say enough about making that transition from taking the, I don't take an aspirin to this day and a leave uh, a Advil, nothing. I don't even take protein shakes or supplements or, uh, you know, any of these other things anymore. I, I have a, a strict cannabis regimen that I use from THC to CBD and all the other things in between. And it's changed my life and, it, and I'm here because of it.